Israel says it carried out strikes on Lebanese territory against infrastructure linked to Hezbollah. Israel's army has said it's on high alert for an escalation with a militant group after a top Hamas leader was killed in a strike in Beirut. The death of Salah al-Aruri, the most senior Hamas member killed since the conflict in Gaza erupted nearly three months ago, has been blamed on Israel despite no claim of responsibility. Twenty-four hours after the strike, Hezbollah chief Hassan Nasrallah said that Israel should expect a response and punishment and warned that if the enemy thinks of waging a war on Lebanon, it will come at a very high cost. Meanwhile, Israeli troops fighting in Gaza Strip were seen regrouping and restocking in southern Israel as heavy fighting raged in central and southern Gaza on Wednesday. Israel's air, ground and sea offensive in Gaza has killed more than 22,000 people, according to Palestinian authorities. Intensive battles in and around Khan Yunis in the south of Gaza have been continuing for several days. Israel says an IDF fighter jet struck an Islamic Jihad weapons production complex. The UN says five people were killed in an attack on the Palestinian Red Crescent building in Khan Yunis as Israel urges people to evacuate the city. Yeah,